Welcome to the Barbell Forecast. Mike Bledsoe here with Doug Larson, CTP behind the camera, of course. And we're going to be talking about what we've done this last month, what we're going to be doing next month, so you guys can be ready. Trust me, you want to hear this today. All right? Uh, we launched the Six Month Muscle Gain Challenge, uh, the newest iteration of that. It starts on January 6th, so that's Monday. So we've got a whole new group of people that are going to get big and strong and really good at Olympic lifts. A whole new mm-hmm. we, we hired Alex Macklin full-time. He's the full-time coach for that program. Uh, he was helping us out with that program before. We only had him on you know, a few hours a week, really, but we hired him full-time. And now he's Mike's bitch. You can edit that out <laughs> so Alex doesn't hear it. That's, what, tell we, that's, Alex. that's what we tell Alex to his face, actually. No, not really. He's, he's Mike's uh, project manager, though. And he, he, he's a great help. So we're really ha- excited to have Alex uh, on the team now because he's fantastic. Basically, I need someone to keep me in check. That's the problem. Yeah, figuring, I'm the problem child. That's right. We, if we can surround you with a bunch of super organized people to capture all your ideas and, and do something with them, I think we're going to do all right. You're the Steve Jobs well, see, of the of the uh, barbell shrug world. That. <laughs> that's, that's we, we didn't say it. Someone else said it. We're just repeating what we heard. I need to keep it up. All right. <laughs> all right. Uh, we're going to be going to Wadapalooza in Miami. So if you live in the southeast area, the region, then uh, come down to Miami for Wadapalooza January 17th through the 19th and hang out with us. We're going to be hosting some talks. So in addition to the competition, there's also going to be this big festival. We're going to be in a tent and we have a lot of guests coming to hang out with us. Actually, I'm going to look them up real quick so I can name them off. Yeah, so if you ever were looking to hang out with us in a tent, now's your chance. <laughs> <laughs> All alone. Uh, yeah, tent. so the, <clears throat> we're calling these the knowledge bombs. So if you go to Wadapalooza, look out for the knowledge bombs. We have uh, ten- Tanner Tennyson from uh, Crossover Symmetry. He's going to be bringing one of his uh, PT brothers with him to, to talk about shoulder health and overhead injury prevention. Uh, we also have Max Max El Haj, who we've had on the show. He's going to be talking about preparing for the Open. Uh, we have Justin Thacker, who is going to be talking about how to warm up effectively for the snatch, clean and jerk. That's going to be really good. It's going to be something you probably have not seen before, I promise. Uh, probably, I promise. Uh, Connor Moore and JC Cormier, uh, they're brand new people on the scene. You probably don't know them. Maybe you do. But you're going to meet them uh, this weekend or that weekend. They're going to be doing touch-and-go techniques for faster Metcons. So if you've ever seen those athletes that are just like touch-and-go and jerks and they touch-and-go snatches and you wonder how they work on that technique, they're going to be going over some of that. CTP is going to be doing uh, how, to social, how to use social media to market your box efficiently. So if you have a box you want to market, he's your guy. <laughs> yep, and that goes for 12-inch, 24, 20s, 30s, whatever you got. <laughs> Ah, ah, I see, I see where you're Jokes on jokes. All right, uh, keep it going, Mike. <laughs> Doug Larson will be speaking. He's going to be talking about. Tell us what you're going to talk about, Doug. Keep it short. I'm uh, basically going to go <laughs> go over. He uh, tends to long, be long winded. I'm very long winded. I, I never shut up. It's, His it's wind a, is long. It's a bad habit. Uh, to, I'm going to do a short talk on how to uh, identify through very easy to do like self assessment uh, where your mobility restrictions are and then tell you what to do about them, how to fix them. All right, that's enough. All right. <laughs> 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 we got Chris Moore speaking. Uh, if you enjoy the Barbell Budo podcast, you should definitely come and hear talk. Do, uh, come here. What? Here, here talk do. Is that what you said? <laughs> Damn, I keep mixing my words up today. So uh, come here. <laughs> come here. You're not talk. getting any better. <laughs> come listen to Chris Moore. The problem uh, is, is that the Chris, Chris Moore doesn't person. even know what Chris Moore is going to talk about. And you're trying to like make up. That's right. like, like you know what he's going to talk about, and really he's going to make it up like that. I think day. this is going to be like a do, comedy hour. He's going to do Barbell <laughs> Buddha in person. So if you want to get an idea of what it might be like, just go to barbellbuddha.com and you, you can figure that out. Uh, we have Zach Avanesh coming to join us. Um, he's been a box owner for a long time. He has a, a powerlifting and, and he's background a little bit, and he's been training wrestlers and a lot of other people uh, in that performance field kind of outside of crossfit too so he's he's trained a lot of athletes uh outside of that he was he was the first person to ever use battle ropes actually i, I have no idea if that's true <laughs> i'm just making that shit up <laughs> i was like really back in like the 1700s he wins the cool name award that's for sure zach evan that is a cool name uh he owns underground gym or underground strength underground so strength. Uh, go check that out we have travis mass joining us uh you probably just saw him on our podcast 
for uh, that we loaded up on January 1. Episode Very 97. Cool. He's going to be talking about squat, bench, and deadlift programming tricks and why to use them. You know what? I talked about Zach, but I didn't say what he was going to do. Zach is going to talk about maximizing success as a gym owner by being true to yourself. So it's not all going to be about athletes. Some of it's going to be about gym owners. And I'll be emceeing the event, of course. God save us. God save us. It's probably going to be terrible. I'm going to try to get everyone excited about everything. So we should be all the time. we should be hopefully podcasting with uh, all of these speakers while we're down at Wadapalooza. If they in if, one of our many barbell shrug mansions that we have around the world. That's right. <laughs> so we're gonna podcast with them. Hopefully we come out of Wadapalooza with uh, four or five or six uh, high quality podcasts with some pretty cool guests. So I'm pretty excited about that. That'll be uh, be coming up here in two weeks. That's right. After that, we're going to Vegas, but you guys don't need to know anything about that. After that, we go to New Jersey. <laughs> I don't know why Tell Doug, them why Doug, we're going to Vegas. Doug put that in the notes. That we shouldn't talk about it? No, you put Vegas on the notes. We are going to Vegas. Uh-huh. We're, we're going to an organizational Market management research. conference. Yeah. To, Super to important work on, to for work everyone on our to know. Everyone should know that we're going to an organizational management conference for a day. I put that down there because if you happen to be in Vegas and you are someone that we need to network with and or podcast with, please let us know. Uh, and let us know where to train. Yeah, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not training in Vegas. I'm just going to put that out there. Even if you plan on it, it probably won't happen. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I'll train. All right. Uh, we're going to New Jersey after going that. To. We're going to hang out with Zach Evanesh uh, at Underground Strength. Uh, who knows what we'll do there? Now, uh, Travis Mash is actually going up to Zach Evanesh's place, and he's going to be doing his level two on February 9th. He's got a level two uh, seminar February 9th at Zach's Gym Underground Strength in Manasquan, uh, New Jersey. But the day before that, he's actually going to be. I probably should announce these in different order. On Saturday, February 8th, he's going to be at Keystone CrossFit. That's that's uh, Travis. I'm trying to... I'm mixing people up. <laughs> I'm not editing this. You're very confused. <laughs> Confusing. Yeah. Travis Mash will be doing his level one seminar at Keystone CrossFit. This is great for uh, beginner weightlifters, powerlifters, athletes, CrossFitters, and anyone who just wants to get jacked. I read that off the website. <laughs> Thank you, Travis. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so uh, we're going to be hanging out with Travis that weekend. We're going to be attending those certifications, and maybe we'll be helping him out. Yeah, hopefully we come out of that with a bunch of videos um, from either either that event or just we might be recording some of the event, but we might also be doing a bunch of other videos, uh, technique wads and, and daily BS type questions, and then probably podcasting with him again. So ho- hopefully we come out of there with a bunch of videos. And on well. that note, we're going to try to bring the daily BS BS. <laughs> I don't know how I said it like that. We're going to try to bring that bad boy back to you guys soon. We're going to try. It hasn't really been daily. Yeah. It's, it's like been more like BS. the, um, every two months and like the, we forgot so. about it. Do, yes. do it. do it for a week straight for a month. Forget about it for six months. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so we're going to be hanging out in uh, Pennsylvania. We're going to go to the Keystone CrossFit. We're going to go to Underground Strength uh, February 8th and 9th. So if you want to come hang out, sign up for those certifications and uh, get your learn on. What was the website they go to? Oh, yeah. Go to MASH Elite Performance. Click on the store, and then you will see some links down there at the bottom under services where you can click on uh, click on the one that says Learn to Lift Keystone CrossFit and the Learn to Lift Level 2 Underground Strength. Travis is, as a reminder, a former world champion powerlifter, so you can get some high-quality advice from that guy. And we don't get any of that money, so you're just helping out our buddy Travis. That's right. Uh, Project delays. (laughs) Put that on the list. We've been trying to launch a new website for a while. It will happen by February 1. That's what... that's what, uh, That's what Vaughn, Vaughn told us. Vaughn, the web guru, he told us it will be done by February 1. If it's not done by February 1, everybody attack Vaughn. What's his Twitter handle? So <laughs> everyone can just give him shit. <laughs> um, obviously, uh, in addition to Travis Mash, we also had uh, Christmas Abbott, which released on Christmas Day. If you have not seen that, if you listened to it, but you didn't watch it, at least go back and watch the intro. That's all I'm going to say. And there's a that. CTP cam in there. Go mm-hmm. watch that. Commercial break. Yep. While we're in New Jersey, we're going to get there a few days early. We're going to go visit Wattify and check out what those guys have got going on. Hang out with uh, that team and see if we can help each other out somehow. If, if you haven't seen it yet, if you are a Wattify user or your, your box has Wattify, they added a new video library, which is all of our demo and technique quad videos. So I uh, had a little bit of a partnership with them on that. They needed a video library. We had a bunch of videos. And so they put our videos um, in their video library, which is awesome for us and awesome for them. 
So good awesome pro- for everybody. It really is awesome for everybody. It's awesome for everyone that uses their, their product too. That's they right. Didn't charge any extra money for it. They just put a bunch of demo videos so everyone could see exactly what which movement they were talking about without having to guess if you didn't know. Upcoming podcast. We have Zach and Sarah Critch. We're going to be uh, doing a podcast with those two. Do we know what the previous episodes they've been on? We've had them on the show before. And Zach and Sarah, Zach and Sarah did Zach and a Sarah was seminar with us. 50 something. 55 yeah. maybe? Have you? If you go to barbellshrug.com, you can see uh, not only uh, an episode we've done with them before, but... Uh, that was a fun episode, by the it way. It was fun. Uh, but we also did a seminar with them. We filmed it, and it's on the website. You can purchase that if Snatch you'd like. Snatch and clean and jerk techniques. That's right. So uh, next week, you should look out for the Zach and Sarah Critch episode podcast. Episode 52. Damn. So they'll now be on episode, what, 97, 98? We're almost to 100, folks. Who knows what will happen on episode 100? Da, na, na, na. It'll be episode 98, yeah. All what right. Sh- what should we do for episode 100? If you have an idea of what we should do for our episode 100, put it on our Facebook wall. Or people you think who should be in it, tweet them in the tweet. For she's you heard. Yeah, we actually have a lack of ideas around here. So if you could post <laughs> some suggestions <laughs> about uh, what episode 100 would be like, let us know. Got anything else for us, Doug? I think I'm out. Out of stuff. I'm out of stuff to talk about. Don't don't let me sit too long. I'll think of more. Should I breathe into my car? <clears throat> the open got announced soon. The open Boom. did get announced February 27th. I guess they're going to announce it on Thursday. We don't have all the details just yet. But the good thing that they did this year that they did better than last year, which is they actually announced the uh, dates and locations of regionals already too. So for those of us that actually buy plane tickets and book hotels ahead of time, that's really helpful thanks hq <laughs> that's all i got like i should give them shit like i'm, I'm better at planning than they are <laughs> they only did it months ahead of time you do everything like the week of that's right all right see you next time